Hey guys, Sandy here, and I thought I would just come on and share a little bit of what I got in my last Paper House uh, design team box. So with Paper House, you can uh, earn products when you're on their design team, and I just wanted to share what I got. So I'm going to uh, start uh, with the papers. <laughs> this is the Be Happy Paper Pad. It also includes a sticker sheet. It has 48 sheets of paper in there, um, and half of them are with foil, so that's really awesome. Um, so here is the sticker sheet. It's got some alphabets. It's pink and cream and black and really pretty. And then there are one, two, three, three of each sheet. So three of these guys. Uh, three cut aparts. Uh, a day without laughter is a day wasted. There's so many beautiful reasons to be happy. Um, happy, happy, happy date. Live simply, dream big, be grateful, give love, laugh lots, enjoy life. Make every day awesome. Then we have these with a happy banner across the top. Now, truth be told, I will probably, if I use this, I will probably fussy cut that out and use this as a piece of paper and add more. And then here is some uh, triangles with gold foil. This would be great to use as a full background page or you can trim it down. Um, you could cut banners out of them. And then three of these beautiful florals. Three more cut apart sheets. This is my day. Think happy, be happy, happiness. Then we have, to me, this is like a square cheetah print to me. Every time I see um, paper like this, this is what I think. It's a square cheetah print. Well, I, I don't mean any colors that are like this, but when it's um, black, white, and another color, it just it just screams square cheetah print to me. So three of these um, gorgeous papers with the gold foiling down here. It says, oh, so happy. This would be something you could easily cover up if you didn't want it to say happy. Then we have a diagonal stripe. Everybody needs a good diagonal stripe. We have this gold dot foil, three sheets of that, and then three sheets of this graph uh, paper with a little floral detail here and some banners over here. This is something you could easily cover up if you didn't want it to say currently. Um, a couple more cut aparts, um, and, uh, currently. Uh, make today count, life is better when you're laughing, make life magical. And then three black and white diagonal stripes, gorgeous. Three of these. This is something you could use just as it is. You could treat this as um, borders and cut them off. A stripe. Oh, only two of those. Okay, that's okay. And then another uh, cut apart sheet with banners. Hi there or hello there, oh happy day, there's always something to smile about, happy, 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 so the story goes. So that is the paper pad that I got. Um, and then I also got the Discover France um, paper crafting kit. Not that I've ever been to France, I don't have a trip planned to France, but there's enough travel in here that I thought it would be good. So we have um, two of each sheet, I think, and this is a cut apart sheet on this side, and on this side is some Florida de lis We have Paris is always a good idea. On the back is a map print, and of course this is a Paris map print, but you could use this for anywhere. Um, some bicycles and wines and French words, and on the back is a black and white bold stripe. We have uh, discover and on the back of this is a world map print um, then we have another cut apart sheet on the back of this is just a black and white pattern with some um, little arrows this would be great this is like a great start for mixed media you could build on top of this then we have uh, travel words and then on the other side just kind of a chevron with a plane a couple different cars a bicycle and a scooter and then the sticker sheet, which has two alphabets and um, all 
all kinds of goods, see the world, embark. So this isn't completely, uh, totally like France. So this is totally something um, I plan on using for travel and maybe some other things. Now the Eiffel Tower, um, the, the definitely, th I mean, things that say France and Paris is a good old idea. These things definitely, I don't know if I will actually use them, um, but they, I figured there was enough good things in this that I could go for it. So we have those. Then I also got um, some individual papers and I've had some of these papers in the past, um, but I wanted them again because they're great papers. So here we have um, this kind of marble paper right here and my daughter thought that this looked like a geode and I agree with her. So we have that one. Um, then I also got this floral paper right here and on the back it has kind of a cursive faded print. I really want to fussy cut these out. Um, some greenery and on the back some different kinds of greenery. This is Explore Your World. I've had a, a, this a couple times, of course, you know I have. Um, cut apart sheet and on the back this yellow. I love this yellow, so I got it for the yellow. I had to get another sheet of this with the um, baggage tags that say BWI uh, because we were originally from Maryland and I just find it amazing that there is um, baggage tags that say BWI. Um, plus the Toronto, Canada ones, um, supposed to go to a event in Toronto, should have been next weekend, but it has been postponed. So want to make sure I had enough of that. And on the back, just some airplanes. This is a Christmas sheet, uh, but I got it for this really dark, uh, wood grain. Then we have um, the great outdoors with this kind of like a honey wood grain and then lots of fishing things. I got it for the honey wood grain. Um, this we have like mountains and on the back tree bark. Now this, you could cut this out and these would be banners instead of mountains. This beautiful uh, night sky and on the back trees. So this would be fantastic for camping or even Christmas, but this sky, look at that, it's gorgeous. Um, Discover USA, which has a bunch of cut aparts and then this beautiful stripe, diagonal stripe. I love this diagonal stripe. These colors make me happy. This is a beach print, um, but on the back is this painted kind of wood, and I love this. Uh, a more beach themed um, with cut aparts, and then on this side, a white kind of painted whitewashed wood look. This is a cut apart sheet with this gorgeous kind of watercolory background. We have a photorealistic flower sheet and on the back, these beautiful roses. Then we have this gorgeous watercolor on this side and this ombre um, striped light pink to dark pink paper here and this beautiful floral. Now I actually have a video where I cut these flowers and put them on top of this stripe, like I fussy cut them and it's gorgeous. Um, but on the back is this beautiful watercolor. So I didn't know if I wanted to fussy cut again. Um, so ultimately I might not decide to do that, but this would be gorgeous for a two page um, spread just to, as the background. Uh, some flamingos, some tropical bits, um, but this pink wood, <laughs> just makes me happy guys like seriously it makes me happy um, here is some more of kind of like the watery um, beachy type thing and on the back yes more wood I don't know what it is but I'm really drawn to these papers they just they just bring me joy um, we have this one um, which is lots of geotags and on the back the road is life this is beautiful like absolutely beautiful um, this side, this is color wash. It has some gold foil on it, so you could cut these up, um, or you could use this gorgeousness on the back. And I'm actually torn. Um, when I got this, when I ordered it, I got it for this side because I thought this was beautiful, and I want and I wanted it to be like this. But then I got this, and these are 
gorgeous. Like, I love this side of it. Like, I don't know. I might have to order another sheet of that. Um, then we have this gorgeousness right here and a cut apart on the back, but it's this, this side, this side makes me happy. And then uh, I got another sheet of this Stargazer paper. Um, I just love this. I just think that's absolutely beautiful. Um, here's another color washed with some gold on it. And then the other side has these little dots. And then I got four sheets of this paper, which has um, starfish on one side and then on this side is just this beautiful beachy thing and I love this and I have an idea for this so that's why I got four sheets of that so there we go we got those now let me show you these things that I also got now in case you guys didn't know, Paper House has a section on their website like daily deals or something like that where they mark down things and it's just a special time that you can get it. Um, so some of those are from this. Um, now this is a, um, it's, you know, it's Disney-esque. I can't say that it is truly Disney because it is not a licensed product. Um, but if you go to any of the Disney parks, this would definitely be something uh, good to use. They are very, very 3D. And I, I just love these. And you guys know I love my Disney things, so I decided to go ahead and grab those. I also have these puffy travel stickers, which I have had before, um, but I loved them so much. And they're very, like, I do a lot of airplane layouts, you guys, so I don't mind, like, using over again the ones that I like. These are travel themed stickers as well. This is called Snapshots. So on the back there are clear stickers and then over here there are these beautiful cardstock stickers. This is a card. Um, it says Adventure Awaits and it's actually a greeting card. Um, you could use it as a greeting card. I plan on using this as something for some journaling like add a little a little tag to it and flip it over. That is my plan, not to use it as an actual um, greeting card. Then I have these travel uh, label stickers, and this is under Life Organized. And it's got silver foil on it. Now these are the same label stickers, but I mean, label stickers are label stickers, guys. Like you can use the same label sticker over and over again. And the same thing with these. I just thought that these uh, cream, black, and gold ones were gorgeous, so I got those. And then I got these um, stickers. Now these are obviously meant for planners, but nobody, like you don't have to use planner stickers just in planners. You can totally use these in scrapbooking, art journaling, whatever you want it to do. I just really enjoy the colors, and I, I love the fact that they're silver. So I got those and then um, I got these two things. So this is something new to me um, from Paper House. This is not something I have tried before, but I thought that this was really cool. So this is a DIY paper craft punch out project pad. It has over 800 hearts in it and um, they're all pre-punched sheets. So all of these papers have hearts already punched out of them. Like, oops, I ripped it a little bit. So you could use whatever side of the heart you want to use. And they're not all the same size hearts. Like this is a big heart. So I just wanted to do a quick flip through this because the colors are gorgeous. It has the gold foiling on it. And there's a bunch of different shaped hearts. So I just thought that this was, this was pretty awesome. So I got that. And then this is a sticker craft set. And I'm not exactly even sure what this is. But it looked like it could be fun. Okay. So we've got some 3D stickers in gold foil. Then we have some leather stickers, or some letter stickers that kind of looks like leather. 
And then this, these are, these are huge sticker sheets. So these map print sticker sheets. So you could die cut these, um, put them on a big project like this is on this big ampersand. Um, really cool though. So I'm excited to do some things with those. So that is what I got you guys. I'm going to go ahead and leave a link down below so you can check out some things if you're interested in shopping. And then of course, please remember to use my code PH. 20 sandy that will get you 20 percent off your order and that 20 percent off your order is not a one-time use code um, you can use it always so i'm really happy that i was able to get these products and i can't wait to show you what i make with them i will see you guys again real soon for another video